Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. My name is Annalise and I'm super excited for today's video because this is the first video I'm making about Pride for Pride Month, which is super exciting. So for those of you that don't know, I am gay. And in today's video, we are going to be reviewing Boohoo's Pride Collection because so many companies have Pride Collections out right now. Some of them are gorgeous and some of them aren't so much. So we're going to see what this is like in real life. But before we get into that, I wanted to thank the sponsor of today's video, which is Omaze. So Omaze is an American company that partners with charities in fundraising events. So this campaign that they're currently running is supporting Folds of Honor. One lucky winner will have the chance to win one of Amaze's biggest prizes yet, which is a beautiful four bedroom, four bath home in Austin, Texas, or over a million dollars cash. Sumptuous living across three levels with unique structural design at 3,250 square feet makes this home an entertainer's dream. Multi-living spaces with private balconies and airy patio doors provide extended indoor-outdoor enjoyment. Extensive custom windows, floor stairs and a serene paint palette embody natural light throughout. A lavish master suite delights with high ceilings and a spa-like bath with a soaking tub, intimate lighting, clean lines and elegant accents. Now you always say that everything is bigger in Texas and you'll certainly be living large in this house built for a modern millionaire. Located in Austin's desirable Travis Heights, you're in walking distance to South Congress Avenue. Where the music is live, the barbecue sizzles and the shopping is top notch. So this home is obviously beautiful but so would be the million dollars cash. If I had a million dollars cash, I would be buying my own penthouse apartment I think in Brisbane CBD that would be what I would do with the money what would you guys do let me know down below and the charity that Omez is supporting with this campaign is Folds of Honor. Folds of Honor is a non-profit organization that provides educational scholarships for spouses and children of America's fallen and disabled service members. Their education scholarships support private education tuition, homeschooling and tuition from grades K to 12 and higher education tuition assistance for spouses and dependents. To date they've awarded over 20,000 scholarships across all 50 states in the US as well as Puerto Rico, Guam, and the Virgin Islands. To potentially win a dream home in Austin, Texas, or over a million dollars cash, and be supporting a great non-for-profit organization, Folds of Honor, be sure to click the link down below or go to omaze.com slash Annalise Wood. I really recommend clicking below, you guys, because it's a great opportunity to be able to help a non-for-profit organization, Folds of Honor. So now, let's get into the whole part of today's video, because I'm super excited to see what these items are like in real life. We're gonna kick it off with the pink item in in this haul. I mean, of course. Oh, I really like this. I don't know why I'm like getting emotional about this, but I am. So this is the first item. It is a uh, tracksuit set. So first of all, it is the hoodie. It's this pink hoodie that says love is love in circles in the pride colors. And then it goes on the back as well. It says a big love is love. And this is something on the, oh, it says crafted with prop. Crafted with pride on the hood. Stop. I love that. Oh, I really like that. Okay, and let's see the pants. So they are shorts, like long shorts, which look, I don't love, okay? For me personally, I don't love this design. I might roll them up. I don't know. We'll see. But it was a part of the collection, so I thought I would just try it out. And it looks to be so cute. I love the little love is love detail. And with all of the Boohoo items, I loved the way they were modeled. They had a traditionally girl and boy. I don't know what their gender pronouns are, so I'm just going to say that. But two people modeling these, so basically anyone can wear them, which I absolutely love. And I love these. Oh, it's just kind of like emotional. I don't know to get emotional in this video but I definitely am just because it's like a big deal that these brands are supporting being gay and it's just been a rough week for me being gay if you follow me on Instagram you know I had someone be homophobic towards me so it's just been a big week and so this is just so cute so the quality on these are absolutely amazing oh the inside is so fluffy you guys so very fluffy. So let's just go try it on and see what we think. I don't know if y'all are familiar with a very popular TikTok sound that says, no, you don't understand. I'm obsessed with this. No, I don't think you understand. I'm obsessed. That is how I feel in this set. I adore it. It is my favorite thing that I own now. So this is the front and this is the back. Well, maybe not the favorite thing that I own because I do wear quite a lot of clothes, but I love this so much. It is so comfortable, first of all. Like, this is really nice and comfy, and I just feel like I could take a nap in it, but that's because I always just want to take naps. So that's probably just a me thing. But uh, yeah, it's very, very comfortable, and obviously the design of being pink and then having, like, love is love, I just think that is so... Oh! Oh, it has pockets. I love that. I just think that is so Annie of it, and I love it. So the shorts I don't love. I knew I wouldn't. I would definitely roll them up. I was messing around with it just before, and I would roll them up to be about here so that they're short enough for me, but they still show the pattern on it. So I think, is that about it? Yeah, about that height is how I would wear it. But if you want to wear them long, 
Obviously, you do you, boo boo. This is just what I prefer to do. The next item is a t shirt. So, I did order a gorgeous skirt that was a part of this collection, but they gave me a refund on it because it sold out, which that is always the worst. When you're looking forward to something, they're like, oops, we all were sold. I'm like, ah, dang it. But it is what it is. What can you do? But I have this t shirt here. Oh, I'll just have something in the back that I showed you first. Yes. Okay, so it is this gray t-shirt that says love is love on it again. And then it says it on the back as well. Love is love. Ah, oh, I just, I really like this. So I got this in a size small instead of an extra small because I like my t-shirts to be a little bit baggy. And this with some like black, uh, what are they called? Biker shorts would be gorge. I don't own any black biker shorts, so... Can't do that, but you know what I mean. It would look super cute. So let's go try this on as well. This is what the t-shirt looks like on, and it's not as amazing as the other outfit, but I don't think anything will ever compare in my life to the other outfit. I mean, okay, maybe that's a bit dramatic. This is the back. That's probably a bit dramatic because, <laughs> I mean, I just really loved that pink set, as you could tell. But this t-shirt is super gorgeous as well. So if I was to style this, because you know, it's me. I would probably either crop it and like tie it up like this or I would tuck it in like so and then have it like kind of hanging out. But it's super cute and I like it. And again, I just really like all these designs. I think they really hit the nail on the head with this collection. So there aren't many items in today's video because this Pride collection was very expensive, okay? So we're on to the lucky last item, which I know it's not many, but I, yeah, I really tried you guys, but Pride collections, they're always a bit more expensive, which I still don't know how I feel about that. Like, people profiting off Pride. I don't know. I like that the companies are showing their support, but the items being extra and being like a novelty, I still, I don't know how I feel. So, I don't know how I feel, so I'm just going to stop talking about that. And we're going to open up the lucky last item. Oh, I really like this a lot. Okay. Oh, I really like this. It is, again, a hoodie, and it's just a white hoodie that says crafted with pride on it and then it has rainbows all up the sleeves and then on the back as well i absolutely adore that and it comes with some matching long tracksuit pants again white and it has rainbows up the side and it says crafted with pride on it and it has pockets are these actually going to be decent pockets wait wait no oh better than like traditional girl pockets uh definitely but Still not great pockets. I love this so much, so let's just go try it on and see what we- This is another item that I'm gonna be keeping and wearing all the time. I was meant to be saving and returning these items, but I'm definitely keeping them. Okay, maybe not with the hood on. I don't suit hoods. This is the outfit, so this is the front and this is the back, and I love it. Again, it's just super, well not super subtle, but quite subtle with the pride on it. It's not like, you know, covered in rainbows. I think a lot of these companies, when they are designing pride collections, they literally just like slap rainbows on and it just looks ugly and tacky. Like the pride flag doesn't have to look ugly and tacky as Boohoo has displayed because the pride flag itself is not ugly nor tacky. It is beautiful and gorgeous. And I just don't know, some of these companies are just like, let's just make it look like a unicorn threw up on this outfit. So Boohoo has understood. Now, this is not me saying that I would not wear a rainbow outfit. Don't get me wrong. I absolutely love rainbows. However, just, I don't know, like this from Target. This is not what we want. This is not what we like. This is not what we need. You know what I mean? There is a happy medium between these two. So I really like this. And oh my gosh, so comfy. I have been wanting a tracksuit set just to like chill around the house in or like on cold winter days, go shopping or something in. And I think that this is absolutely perfect. So I'm obsessed with this. I'm obsessed with this collection and I'm super happy with it. And those are all the items that I bought from Boohoo's Pride collection. Overall, I really liked this. I loved how the designs were subtle and I absolutely adore the good quality on it. So I do recommend it. It is is a little bit expensive but overall I recommend this collection be sure to comment down below what pride collection I should review next because I am super curious what you guys would like to see so also be sure to follow me on Instagram TikTok, and all that fun stuff I'll have my links on the screen right now and also link down below and I am also vlogging as well so be sure to follow me on there as well and that's all for today's video I love you guys so so much thank you again to our maze for sponsoring today's video and I'll see you guys in my next one bye happy pride Mwah. Thank you.